Hello everyone, today I'll be teaching you how to quickly animate your character for your game. So let's get started. First you want to export your Blender model, and you can do it by right-clicking on your character on the side and selecting Select Hierarchy. Then go to File, Export and FBX file. Make sure the selected object button is checked. Now Google Mixamo Animations, and you either have to make an account or log in. Since I already have an account, I'll be signing in. Now if you go to characters on the top left, you can choose a variety of different characters and you can animate them and add them into your game. Or you can press this upload character button and navigate to your saved FBX file. Wait for it to process and then it says to make sure your character is in a T-pose for the best possible quality. I tried uploading my character that's not in a T-pose and it didn't work well so I suggest you make your models in a T-pose. Click next and adjust the markers as said, use chin on a chin, place wrists, elbows and knees. This is your personal preference but be as careful as possible. You can also choose what type of rig you want. I put no fingers since my character doesn't have any and there's a couple of options and you can set the amount of fingers your model has. Make sure you don't put more fingers than you actually have since it would lower the optimization in Unity. Click next and wait for the algorithm to do its job. After that you can check if your rigging process was done correctly. And now on the left you can see all the animations available and you can click and see how they look. There's 52 pages of animations and you can search them on top. I'll download three animations, first being the running animation, and after choosing your animation you can tweak it on the right. And when you're ready to download it, press download and choose FBX for Unity. I'll download two more animations, the hidden balls one and the dancing one. Now open up Unity and I'll make a quick scene. And while we're here, make sure you like and subscribe for more videos. Also, check out my other videos, thanks. Go to your downloaded files and add the animations. I find it best to go one by one. Click on the first important animation and choose these settings. You only have to do this on your first animation or on your already existing character. You only need one model. Make an animation controller and double click it. Drag the animation onto the animator and drag the animation controller to the animator on the player. As you can see the animation works. Now we add another animation. This time I'll put the balls one. Again. No need to set up the avatar again, just drag it onto the animator. I made some parameters to tell which animation will trigger next. I added conditions and I turned off exit time. I made a simple script to play the animation when I press a button. Now you can see how this looks.
now I'll add my last animation, which is running. Now drag it into the same animator controller as these two and I made some parameters and conditions. Also check off the exit time. Now I run the game and the finished product looks like this. Make sure you like and subscribe. Also check out my other videos, I put a lot of effort into them. This week there will be another episode of the devlog and I made some pretty big changes, so stay tuned for that. Thank you so much for watching and I'll see you in the next video.